I got to looking at something and I didn't like what I was seeing and that's the color of the fuel. You know, when I was doing the diesel purge, when I was going through the process of rebuilding the fuel injectors, I kept looking at the color of the diesel fuel in that little plastic pre-filter and I thought, you know, I wonder if the fuel in this car is real old. Now this has gotten a lot of people fooled in the past. You get a hold of an old diesel that's sat for a while and with old fuel, it can do all types of weird stuff. It can smoke to high heaven, it can have no power, <laughs> it can be hard starting. When you park a car <laughs> and let the fuel just sit in the tank, diesel fuel <laughs> will, will deteriorate. You know, I, I said, okay, before I roll this thing in the shop and start doing a lot more difficult work on it, let's do something simple here. Remember I say, do the simple things first. And that's that I wanted to run it on fresh fuel, fuel that I've just purchased at the service station within the last week. Well, the problem is I don't want to have to get this car up in the air and drain out 15 to 17 gallons. <laughs> what a mess. You get that all drained out, then what are you going to do with it? And then, of course, you know, you got to go get some more fuel and pour it in. And <laughs> I have a solution, and it has to do with what we manufacture here at Mercedes Horse. This is our emergency fuel tank and also our diesel purge tank. Well, this tank here will also allow you to run a diesel on fresh diesel fuel and you will literally bypass the fuel tank screen, which can be a problem. You'll bypass all the fuel lines and the fuel tank itself if you've got a venting problem or something else. So I decided this isn't gonna take very long. I can hook up this tank here and I can put you know, fresh diesel in it and within 10 to 15 minutes, I'm going to know whether or not clean fuel is gonna solve that smoking problem. If you look here, now I just hooked up the tank and I primed it. And of course, the return fuel coming into this pre-chamber here, look at how dark that is, compared to the fresh fuel here. You know, real dark, kind of a greenish color, and then the fresh fuel here is much lighter, more of a yellowish color, typical of the diesel fuel you see currently being pumped out of the pumps at the service station. So the fuel tank is hooked up, and we're just going to run this engine on this tank here, just to make sure I'm really running 100% pure fuel, I decided to pour out this old fuel that I had primed back out of the injection pump. That's what's so nice about this twin chamber tank. The return fuel is coming into this small chamber and then rising up before it goes into the bigger chamber. So you can kind of monitor what's returning from the pump. So I'm gonna remove the lid now on this end. Let's see if I can pour this out without pouring out a lot of the other diesel fuel. Yeah, I'm losing a little bit out of the vent hole. I'll plug that vent hole up. Okay, that looks a little better. Now you can see the comparison. See that, that old fuel, how green it is compared to the new fuel? Okay, now I'm gonna put that cap back on and we'll be ready to fire this engine up. Okay, now you can see it circulating clean. Look at the return fuel coming in here and rotating right back into this bottom tank. And then it's being pulled out and going straight back into the pre-filler into the bottom of the ejection pump. This has turned out to be a pretty cool tank. You know, when I first developed this a number of years ago, I had in mind creating a tank that people could use if they ran out of fuel. So we call this the emergency fuel tank. You can put a little diesel in it, plug it up, carry it, in the back, in the trunk, or in the back of your wagon. And if you're out in the road and you either uh, had a filter plug up or something and you started to lose power, you could get out and hook this tank up and, you know, get home. Just, you don't need much fuel or at least get off the freeway to get somewhere where you could work on the car. But then, shortly after that, it became uh, obvious that we could use this to do diesel purchase very quickly and really monitor the quality of fuel running through this tank because of the twin chambers there. So it became our diesel purge tank. And then it evolved into what I call the overall general engine fuel system test tank. And that's what we just did. We did a test of the fuel system. And sometimes if you're having problems with an old diesel like this, 
you're just losing power, the engine's not running right, it, it feels like it's just not getting enough fuel. You could have a number of issues. You could have a fuel tank screen plugged in the tank. You could have some restriction in your fuel lines. You could have some other issues that might not be related to the actual engine in the injection pump. So by hooking this tank up and bypassing the fuel tank and the screen and the fuel lines going back to the tank and just looping the fuel through this tank here while the engine runs, you can narrow down some problems. And as you saw earlier in this video, I, you know, I was really suspicious about the quality of this fuel. And so very quickly, if you think that maybe you've got gasoline in the fuel tank, or maybe that somebody's got old fuel in the tank, or you've got algae in the fuel, or some other problem, take this tank, put fresh fuel in it, and like you just saw, run the engine. You can actually, you know, just secure this tank with some zip ties, and you can get out on the road and drive this thing, and under power, you're gonna find out whether or not the problem is related to the fuel system, you know, back there or the fuel in the tank or so on. In this case, I don't think the fuel is the, the big cause of the black smoke. I did notice it ran a little bit better and I did take it out of the road and I did notice a little more power. So obviously old fuel does affect the performance of a diesel engine. So here it is, folks. This is our emergency fuel tank, our diesel purge tank and our engine fuel system test tank.